Yo, what is going on guys, Vortec Gaming here, and welcome back to another new series, I know, and also by the way, what's been going on? I did like three videos in three days, this will be four and four, it's a miracle, um, <laughs> but yeah, we're, we're here, we're here with a new series, um, it's it's the Hexagon Challenge, um, if you don't know what the Hexagon Challenge is, um, basically, I have to win all six Champions Leagues on every continent, so I have to win... The UEFA Champions League, the CONCACAF Champions League, the Copa Libertadores, etc, etc. Um, so yeah, I've got a couple of additional leagues um, loaded. So we've got New Zealand, we've got a couple of Oceanic leads. I think I think we've got New Zealand, Tahiti and Fiji, if I remember rightly. Let's go have a look. Let's have a quick look. Let's have a quick little gander. Um, so we've got, we've got New Zealand, we've got Fiji... We got Tahiti, and then also we have um, we have got we've got Japan, we have got Qatar, we have Syria because why not? Um, Thailand, I don't believe they're in the actual game, and we've also got the United Arab Emirates and Vietnam, um, which I I don't believe any of those are in the game defaultly uh, by default. So uh, yes. So we started unemployed, we've started with no reputation, we started with no coaching badges, and as you can see, very much like the Hero Challenge, our adaptability is 8. And that is just because, well, yeah, we're going to be moving around quite a lot. Um, so, yeah, hopefully we're going to get a decent job. Um, we're not going to spend too much time, you know, kind of going about it. Uh, as you can see, there are many, 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 many jobs in New Zealand, and I've applied for most of them. <laughs> I was going to apply for all of them, but there's just too many. I also need a new badge pack, um, because, yeah, I don't have, I have hardly any of the badges. Like, seriously, like, none of these teams have badges. Um, I did, I was, I literally, I started this save, and then I thought, oh, I need to I need to download the metallic badge pack because that has twice as many as the one that I'm currently using. So I go and sort it out. So I, and my account is no longer premium. <laughs> I forgot to pay my subscription. Uh, no, I didn't forget to pay my subscription. But there's something wrong with my PayPal at the minute, which means I can't I can't use it, which sucks. So yeah, uh, can't do that at the minute, which means we've just you know, yeah, it's not great. It's not great. But we have already been linked with a job, and as you can see here, East Coast Bays, who do actually have a badge, which I'm surprised at, uh, but they are in the New Zealand NRFL Premier Division. Um, I don't know what tier of New Zealand that is. I believe it's the second tier. It is the second tier. So we've been linked with a job in the second tier of New Zealand, um, which I would take... So I'm going to go away now, and I'm going to come back to you when I have a job. Right. Okay. Um. Right. Okay then. So here we are. We have we have taken over a team. We are going to be managing Takapuna FC. Um, I had the choice between three clubs. Um, there was Takapuna, who we obviously went with. Um, Ferrymead Bays and East Coast Bays. Now Ferrymead, um, I think I think I chose that just because it rem it kind of reminded me of somewhere from Harry Potter. Oh Hogsmeade, never mind. Right, <laughs> um, East Coast Bays. Whilst it was tempting, um, they are an amateur club um, in the New Zealand second tier. So it, I'm bad at managing at the best of times so I'm not sure how we would have um, how we would have coped um, it, at an amateur club with players just taking teams just taking players left and right and centre although I was tempted to go with them just because they had a badge um, but I can't where where would they where are they predicted to finish in the table second right and Takapoon right they're not in that. Okay. Um, 
mistake, big big mistake there. Um, where what 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 tier are we in? Okay, division what right? Third tier. Third tier. Okay. Well, glad. <sighs> glad we worked that out. Um, actually, I don't know. Are we in the? Hang on, regional first, regional premier. Um, oh yeah, of course we can do it from here, can't we? Um, so we're in the regional first, which is here. We've got regional premier, and then yeah, so we're in the third tier. And if we'd have taken the East Coast Bay's job, we would have been in, we would have been in the second tier. Right. Okay. So let's, you know, let's. I don't want to do that. That's that's, that's boring. Um, let's have a look at the team. Let's have a look at the squad. So here we go. Who is our best player? Ben Herbert, 16-year-old left winger. He has very good crossing and very good determination. He's not very fast, though. He's he's. I tell you what, though, he's not bad for 16. Um, obviously, I, I had to press the um, add players to teams because otherwise there just would have been no players at any teams. I uh, also have Simon Webb, so our our main threats are from the right and left from the left and right wing. So they're from the wings. So I guess we'll be using wide players. Uh, again, Andrew Pierce, the third best player at the club. Fantastic determination again, twenty five years old. Um and yeah. Uh physicals are good apart from his <laughs> apart from his pace. His strength and balance aren't great. But he's not very fast, which isn't fantastic in this kind of tier, in this kind of country. Adam Morgan is our first central player to be fairly decent. Um, obviously, I will be looking for players to come in. Uh, I'm not sure when I will be doing that because I think I I may have accidentally started in the Japan start date, but I've decided I accidentally did it Japan in January 2015. So, yeah, I, yeah, we, the, the league doesn't start until, um, until, until November, actually. So, shut up, phone. Um, I may have to holiday for a bit. And when I say a bit, I mean 11 months. Well, actually, no, maybe more nine months. Because obviously we need to sort out the team. Um, but yeah, I mean, that's. Uh, I'm not sure what I can really show you now. Um, who's our worst player then, or who's our highest potential? Ben Herbert, obviously. Then we have got S Sam Anderson. Who is this person? Um, oh my goodness! Look at that face. Look. Oh my god. This man, I don't even care. He is starting. I don't care if there's a better goalkeeper in the squad. He is my number one. He is playing. How old is he? He is 16. He is not 16. No, sir. No way. What do they What do they use on their face in New Zealand? Holy fuck. <laughs> that, is, that is genuinely impressive. I am impressed. I can't remember if I have the face, um, the hair update or or what, but yeah, that was that was that was quite something. We've got Sam Illich as well, Illich, um, who again looks fairly decent. His dribbling's poor, and he's not very fast. Ah, oh, see that that is the most frustrating thing ever is having a very slow striker, a very physically poor striker. That is the most. We've got Matt Smith. The doctor's here, and he has very similar hair, actually. Um, so we've got Matt, Matt Smith, who's 27. He's not brilliant, but he is a bit better physically than uh, Sam Illich. Uh, strikers, otherwise, we have Andrew Mike Miklos. I'm going to say Miklos with that. Um, again, he's fairly decent physically, and he's he's not that bad overall, actually. Um, yeah, he's he doesn't he's not very smart. His concentration is um, one, so he didn't really play pay attention in school, did he? 
Um, that's it for there. Under 20s, I doubt we've got any players in the under 20s. Oh, we do. Fantastic. Cameron Moore, who has five star ability, so I'm not quite sure why he's in the reserves and not the first team. Um, that's going to be something we do now. Move to senior squad. And we're going to do the same with Rob Smith, who, again, wide player. We seem to have a few wide players who can do well. He's quite good physically um, for this level of football. Um, good determination, teamwork, and work great, which are some very key um, stats, in my opinion. Tries to play his way out of trouble. I hate that. Although that's not that's not too bad in this kind of role. I do have it on my hero challenge in defense, which is never a good thing. So we've got Rob Smith. Um, they're all these guys all have good potential. They are all on twenty five pounds a week though, so that will in eat into the wage budget. Um, okay, so we've got we've got about two hundred and fifty pounds a week to play with. I I did I did toy with the idea of have putting it in New Zealand balance. Uh, what would it, what would that be? New Zealand dollars. Okay, this guy Nick Stevens is very fast. He can go in the first team, just because he's fairly fast. Um, right, I'm going to leave it there, because I have to I have to manage... Yeah, I have to get... I have to holiday. I might just leave the computer on overnight to holiday. Um, because it will take forever. If, yeah, I'm going to do that. Right, I'm going to go now, because it is, what, as I'm recording this, 1 o'clock in the morning. Bang on. Like, literally, it is 1 o'clock in the morning. Um... Like, dead. Like, dead. Okay, maybe a few seconds later. But I'm going to go now, and I'm going to holiday, and I'm going to turn my... Com no, I'm not. I'm going to leave the computer on. We have £635 in the bank. How good is that? So, yeah. Takapuna FC is our first side in the uh, in the good old Pentagon Challenge. No, Hexagon Challenge. Sorry, Hexagon Challenge. Um, and, yeah. That's it, guys. So... Can we win? Can we get promoted up into the divisions? Uh, I may look for shortcuts. This isn't the same as the Hero Challenge. I don't have to stay at this club. Uh, I don't have to stay at Takapuna to win the to win the Champions League. I can I could go anywhere I like. Um, so if a job opens up in the New Zealand Premier League and we're doing quite well, which I very <laughs> I very highly doubt. Um, yeah, we'll we'll probably try and get that job. Um, Although it would be nice to kind of get get promoted with Takapuna, this is a very ambitious save. This is probably more ambitious than than the Hero Challenge, in the fact, in the kind of sense that I have never won anything on FM sixteen. Like I've I have not won a single trophy, um, and I'm gonna try now and win six Champions Leagues and the Club World Cup. Cause why not? So yes. I'm going to leave it there. The, the The board are very happy with my control of the club finances, funnily enough, um, even though I've been in charge for about 10 minutes. That's a good thing. Easy to please. Very easy to please. In 10 minutes, I haven't put the club in debt, which is the complete opposite of what's happened at Solvid in my offline save. Let's not talk about that. Um, yes, I am going to go now. Um, so, yeah... <laughs> Thank you very much for watching, guys. If you liked the video, then please leave a like and let us know what you think of the video in the comment section down below. And uh, yeah, let us let us know what you think. Are we gonna Are we going to win all six Champions Leagues? I very highly doubt it myself, but you know, are we gonna do it? I don't know. Let's find out together. You, me, um, Barney the Bear. Um, oh fuck! Barney was a dinosaur, wasn't he? Oh dear. Oh, I've had a mare. Okay, I will see you in the next episode, guys. Peace.